hope you're not the baby no more. No, but she must have been involved because she's got stuff on her. Well, are you good, Mama? You had three babies all by yourself? Oh, yeah. Early. You were early, girl. <laughs> Look at them. Already? Yeah. They're dry. Oh, you cutie too. They're all cute. Oh, they're so cute. Mom. I'll put you in the back room today, Mama. Oh, yeah. So cute. She must have had them last night. She must have had them last night at some point. She's early. What is she? Three days early? Yeah. Look at how cute you are. I think I'm going to give them a shot of Boise. This one's a little sprawled leg. This one looks like one of They're so little. They are tiny. She had three of them. Oh, we didn't even get to see it well though, and I checked you last night. What do you think, Blossom? What do you think? Hope's like, I don't like this. I'm not the baby no more. Are you going to be a good mama? I um, hope, but reverse. Oh, you're so soft and cute. Yeah, nice and warm. Oh, you're a good protective mama, huh? Oh my gosh, they're so little. They are so little, aren't they? I'll get her some her own water bucket now. You taking good care of your babies, Willow? Mm -hmm. That one's going to nurse. Let's see if it nurses. That's not where you nurse. There you go. Nope. It's trying to nurse. It's looking for mama. She nursed in the white one? I think so. Yep. You being good mama Willow. Good girl. Three cute little babies. Gina said Tanner woke up last night at about 2.30 in the morning barking and groveling. And now she's wondering if that's when Willow was having the babies. Could be. Maybe he knew what was going on out in the barn. You look like you have a puzzle piece. You three are so cute. You girls be good. You're gonna stay inside today. We're gonna keep all the doors shut up. Hey. You're being a good mama, Willow. Good morning, Modern Steaders. Willow had her babies yesterday. That was a surprise. She's three days early. It was a day we normally don't video. And we got about two inches of rain yesterday. So we didn't have the best videoing opportunities with the rain. So we stopped it short and we're gonna pick up right here where we left off yesterday. Good morning, piggies. You ready for breakfast, pork and chop? You're getting awfully long. Holy moly. I can't get over how much these pigs have grown already. Come on, you crazy white chicken. Is that some good grain? That chicken better watch out before she loses a toe, huh? She puts it in the grain pile, you're gonna snatch it off on her. Is that some good water?
you coming over to say good morning, Figaro? Good morning. You pulled an all-nighter last night. What'd you do, huh? What'd you do last night? She knows we're going to let the chickens of New York City out. She's like, I'm ready. Let's go. Somebody made a mess over here. Is that you, Dex? Holy moly. My guess is there was a puddle there from all the rain and the ducks were having fun playing in it. You don't want to go in at night, but you want to go in in the morning. Crazy duck. All that rain barrel's full of water. <laughs> we won't have to worry about lugging water up to New York City anytime soon. Morning, guys. No, get in. Come on. No, come back. They'll come back in for the feed. get the meat birds out on pasture but they're calling for a lot more rain this week so I gotta figure out if it's worth it if they're ready to go out on pasture or if we're better off keeping them in the greenhouse for another week letting them completely feather out and get a little bit bigger it's gonna be kind of chilly and if they're on the grass it's gonna be really damp and that could not end well for quite a few of them so I'll have to keep an eye on our weather and keep them in from the greenhouse probably a little bit longer than we really want to you girls ready to go see some baby goats? Yeah. We've been waiting. You've been waiting all morning? Yeah. Yes. Morning, girls. You want some alfalfa? Oh. What do you girls think, huh? Livies, they already ate all the seaweed you brought out. They did? Yep. Guess we'll have to bring out more. <laughs> You'll have to, yeah. There you go, Mama. Look at the cute baby goats. You're a good mama, Willow. Which one's your favorite, Livies? This one. That one? This one's nursing. It's yep. It's the one that always seems to be nursing. It's the biggest one, too. 
I think this is the smallest one out of the three. So Willow is pulled, which means she naturally doesn't have horns. So we're trying to figure out if the babies are pulled or if they're going to have horns. We need to disput them. You come to say hello? Look at this one, just lying down and nursing. Might have a carlic right there. I don't know if that's going to be where a horn is, but it's only in one spot. Or if it's like where Willow licked them. This side doesn't have nothing. I don't feel nothing. You like your baby goats, Livies? Yeah. You got baby goats behind you and you're trying to shake over them. They're so small. They are tiny. You're so tiny. Can't wait till the weather gets a little nicer we can take you outside when it's not raining out. Yeah. Buttercup playing with the water dish. Oh, I was like... Oh, water container. What do you think, Buttercup? You're not the only child no more. She's like, yeah, I don't want to talk about it. You being a good mama, Willow? You are, huh? You're letting all three of them nurse off you. That one's such a cutie. I love the coloring. I want to show you its ears, but I don't know if you can see them. All speckled and dotted. Look at its ears. This one's got such awesome coloring and markings on it. Like a public piece. Yep. <laughs> There's a board right here, so it stepped on the edge and rolled over. Oh, goodness. What <sighs> just happened, Willow? Got some bad footing, huh? Uneven ground. Yeah, uneven ground. Oh, well, they're gonna start getting hoppy soon. Oh, yeah. Oh, she wants to go and think hoppy. Oh, where's mom? Where's mom? Where's mom? I wonder. There we go. Oh, well, well, it says, Are these my babies? I gotta double check again. You're that such. That feels good when it gets on your face, the little tail. Oh, oh. It's fanning her. Yeah. You're such a good mama. You are. Where's the other one? Oh, they're all is that what you do when you let them milk? You chew your cud? Yes. That's what I always see her doing. They're all eating. They're all eating. She's chewing her cud. Yeah. They're eating and she's re-eating. Yeah. She's having seconds. What do you think, Willow? You like being a mom again? You're nice Not and too bad. You're nice and calm now. It's kind of noisy you eating your cud that time. The chewy one. She had a lot in there too. A little chunky? When she nurses, she gets her chewy Bottom of her feet. It's feet. Oh yeah, it's got some weight right there. On both rear ones. Yeah. That's different. That is different. 
That one like you? I guess so. Going back for more milk. Constantly drinking. What do you think, Hope? You won't be the low goat on the totem pole anymore, huh? You'll have some new babies to play with too once they can come out. Oh, that sun feels so good. Stay out, stay out. I know, right? The piggies must be napping. What are you doing, Chops? Want some lunch? Ready, guys? That'll get you out. Come on, pick, 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 pick. Let me get him some water. Oh, here comes that white chicken. Yep, every time food comes out, she comes around. Right, Silly. Up in the feeder. Oh, she's got a routine. Yeah. You're late. They almost ate it all. I don't think that <laughs> pigs aren't supposed to like chickens. Yeah. Or is it the opposite? I don't know. Our pigs never have minded chickens, but a lot of people say that pigs will eat chickens. Well, <laughs> she gotta watch out. So I told her with one, I said, you keep your foot there, they'll probably end up eating your foot. I got some food in it. Everybody else wants some too. Yeah, Tanner's jealous. Ready to go check on the baby goats? What are you gonna do, Tanner and Pluto, huh? You gonna behave yourselves out here? They're like, no. Oh. How you doing, Willow? You letting your babies nurse? The back two is sleeping. And were you just nursing little one? Oh, are you stretching from waking you from your nap? Yeah. You're a cutie. They're all cuties, Willow. And you're being a good mama. Yeah, you are. So I do believe all three goats are pulled, which means they won't be growing horns. You enjoying the sun, Hope? Are you following us? Huh? You know we're bringing you some bread. Oh. Tanner, stay over here. He's doing his job. Usually he's scared of the chickens. Oh gosh. 
Oh, Tanner. Right over. Good job! <laughs> The ducks want some. We can't figure out which one they want. No, nope. they want every new piece that goes in there. So they eat it like dinner? I can't even see it. And it's like, what about me? What about me? You don't eat this stuff. <laughs> Strawberries look to be coming back yeah. nice and strong. How's the garlic doing? They're getting wet. I don't know why they'd be getting wet. We only got two inches of rain the other night. We got a rough job the next couple of days having to keep coming down and checking on baby goats. It's terrible, isn't it? It is terrible. <laughs> it's so quiet. Everybody's relaxing. They were sleeping. How you doing, Mama? Huh, how you doing? You want your legs hanging out? Is that better? Look at the brown and the black around its eyes. So cute. So cute. They're so nice and soft. I like your pink nose. I think that one's enjoying the cuddles. How are we gonna get anything done? Well, you're getting goat cuddles done right now. That's your job. It's, it's a hard one. It is, isn't it? Sounds like you're sucking through a straw, Willow. Oh, okay. That one's just paddling with a piece of hay. What are you doing? They are entertaining, that's for sure. Playing with all its tongue. Nap time. I think so. I like nap time. That one's awfully content. He's sleeping standing up. Sleeping standing up? Good thing I can't do that. He's got a pink nose with black spots on it and lips. 
looks like it's rolling over and falling asleep. Yep. Sleeping nice and content. Uh oh! <laughs> That's so cute! It's kind of creepy looking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what are you doing? Back down. <laughs> Seriously? Seriously? <laughs> She's leaving you. Why? Oh, it was nice cuddling. It was nice cuddling you. Right now. It's time to check in on the baby goats. We'll go see how they're doing and we'll lock them all up. And Willow has been a great mother. In the next video we'll have to check and see what the gender is of the baby goats. Hoping that we got all girls. That'd be so much fun. We'll have to wait and see how many girls we got. Which ones are the girls and which ones are the boys. You girls want your night snacks? Got you your own feed, Willow. How y'all doing? Oh, all the babies are still doing good. Willow wants her night snack. There you go, Mama. I know, I woke you. I'm sorry. When I went down the other morning, to go feed the goats and I opened the door and there was three baby goats standing in the barn right next to all the other kids. I was not expecting that. I had put all the goats to bed about 9, 10 o'clock that night and Willow, her ligaments were still tight, her belly hadn't dropped. She was jumping around up and down on the milking stand and I thought it, the next day was going to be just as normal as the rest of them. Well, that turned out to be wrong. We had a lot of issues with our camera that morning. I don't know if it was all the rain we were having, it was messing with the electronics, but there's quite a few clips that just got lost, unfortunately. We had the surprise pot of the baby goats. that We had that all on camera, we thought, but there was n none of those clips are on the camera anymore, so I'm sorry for that. It's discouraging for us because we don't get to have those memories for us or to share with you guys, but all we can do is roll with the punches, make the best of it, and we have three beautiful baby goats, and I can't wait to find out how many of them are girls and how many of them are boys. So thanks for coming along on our journey with us, guys. In the next video, we're going to be figuring out which ones are boys, which ones are girls, and we'll see you right back here at Lumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom.